Hi guys, all right, it is December 5th? Yeah, 5th, 6th? Crap, what day is it? Today is the, it is the 6th, okay. Um, we just got back from our lunchtime walk. Let's see if I can actually show Tater now. Well, he's in the sun. He's choosing to be in the most awkward place for lighting. Um, but we got a package. So let me set the tripod down on the ground and we will open it. This is a package for Tater. Okay. We got our Greyhound order from Etsy. Um, Tater's collar is from there, and I got some other stuff. So, let's see. So I love that there's a sticker on the bag. All right. Oh, there's a cute little inside bag, a little Christmassy brown and red paper bag with another sticker on it to the brand, and then I believe see one for us or no um there's the little collar care sheet um but yeah they're really easy to wash off he's gotten his like super muddy before and yeah you just really have to get it wet and maybe use a little bit of uh doggy shampoo and yeah stuff comes off pretty easy um it says you can use a toothbrush to get it off but i've never even had to scrub it with a toothbrush before let's see if we get a sticker no i don't think we got a sticker you can put your whole head in there. You've got your whole head in the bag. <laughs> There's nothing in there for you. That's just the invoice, buddy. This is for you, though. Okay. And do, do, do. All right. So we got, first of all, um, when we ordered his collar, the shop owner, Naya, just did collars, but now she started doing leashes. So I got him a PDX carpet leash. <laughs> Buddy. <laughs> He's so silly. I got him a PDX carpet leash to match his collar. So he can have a matching leash. So the handle is the, like, um, cotton, and then on the inside it's got the webbing. Um, just like his collar. So this is just like a handle part and then the rest of it is this nice black leather. So there's just kind of like a little strap that goes on it, basically. Um, so yeah, it should be nice and sturdy and stay clean. And then there's a little clip like this. This is a different style of clip than what we have. Okay, huh, opens like that, that's different. Okay, so we've got that, and then for Christmas, I got him a special Christmas collar. So we got the ugly sweater pattern. There we go. There's the light. Um, yeah, so it looks like that, and then I got the matching leash, too. So we're going to use these all through December and January and also February because we need to get as much use out of these as we can because they're seasonal but I just thought it was so cute and I couldn't resist getting it um but yeah so I'm gonna get his collar already I ordered him a tag that looks a lot like this um and a bow tie from other brands which are both on their way still um so he will be all decked out in a couple of days Tater look at you you are just like the saddest boy like, Tater has gone into hibernation, I think. He's been so lazy the past couple days because it's been cold. And to try and get him to move, I covered him in toys because to, I figured he would get mad about being covered in toys and move. And he hasn't really. He moved his head, but he's still covered in toys. And I think he doesn't mind it, actually, because they're keeping him warm. <laughs> he's burrowing under his toys. So <laughs> that's what's going on. Okay, so I am all done with work for the day. Um, so we're gonna get started on our after work tasks for the day. Um, so I haven't touched the corgi ornaments since I started painting them. God, that was, let's see, that was the third, so what, that was Monday? And it's Thursday. 
Um, so I need to get those finished because I want to give them to everybody at our Corgi Christmas party on Saturday. Um, so I still need to put the faces on, four out of six of them, and then I need to actually paint the other two. Well, one of them, one of the other two is mine, but you know, I want to have mine done when all the others are done too. Um, so first of all, I am making myself some Corgi Christmas sweater or not corgi Christmas wear, uh, gingerbread corgi mug tea. And so I can have that to drink while I work on painting the ornaments. Um, I don't remember if I, ooh, lighting. Let me turn the other light on in the kitchen. I don't remember if I did like a final update. I guess I did, but um, anyways, here are, let me switch the viewfinder over. Here's where we're at with the ornaments. So as you can see, these four, their bodies are painted, but they still need faces. And then these two are just painted white right now, so they need to be painted colors. Um, and then I still need to ornamentize them. That's now a word. Um, I have a hot glue gun, and then I have ribbon. I was going to put ribbon on the back, so I need to do that as well. Um, I might do that tomorrow or Saturday morning, because the party's not until 2 on Saturday. Um, but I definitely need to finish painting them tonight. Um, so yeah, I'm going to work on painting these guys. And then uh, I've got a little bit of grad school work to do. And then after that, um, then I'm probably going to do some more Christmassy stuff of wrapping. And yeah, I guess just wrapping. I already decorated. So yeah, wrapping. <laughs> Let's go outside We can hang out on the beach without freezing Yeah, isn't that amazing? In Christmas times We'll be chilling and having a good, good time Doesn't matter if the snow is falling This is what the ornaments look like when they are all painted. Um, so I still have to put the ribbon on, but they are all good to go. So we have Toast. We have Dipper. We have Taro, who doesn't smile. So he has a little resting, judgmental face. Um, Mochi. 
Enzo, who is a sable, so I tried to give him some like darker brown bits to him. And then Tater.